On the 15th of February 2016, an MSF-supported hospital was hit in a series of airstrikes in which 25 people were killed and 11 wounded. Although reports suggested that the incident took place in the city of Marat al numan the hospital was in fact located roughly six kilometres south, in the village of Al-Hamidio. Several raids were carried out in the area at different times of the day. Footage of some of these was recorded by bystanders and uploaded online. Two videos capture the strike that hit the MSF-supported hospital. We can identify the hospital in both videos by identifying its ruin. Once we have located the hospital, we can establish the position of the cameras through triangulation, confirming these were, in fact, footage of the strike that hit the hospital. The first round of attacks on the hospital occurred at approximately 9am in a sequence of four strikes. The hospital director said it was first struck at 9.02, then immediately after at 9.05. Following the first round of attacks, a rescue operation was directed by the Syrian Civil Defence. Because the hospital was hit during the changeover time between the night and day shifts, the patient count had not yet been carried out making it harder for first responders to know how many people might have been trapped under the rubble. At approximately 9.45am, according to the director, a second airstrike was carried out against the hospital building and its surroundings. Several videos captured this strike. In the footage, we can identify the wreckage of the hospital, as well as members of the Syrian civil defence running for shelter as planes fly over the area. At 11am, the director said that he travelled from al Hamidia to the National Hospital, which is located in a northern neighbourhood of Marat al numan According to his statement, a moment after arriving, the National Hospital was bombed. Two videos capture the strike on the National Hospital. In order to determine at what time the video was shot, we located the position of the camera and established its orientation. We use a second frame to locate the impact area. An image of the strike, taken from a different orientation, allowed us to triangulate the location of the impact area. Once the orientation of the camera is established, we perform a shadow analysis. We time the video to approximately 11.55 a.m. The Free Syrian Army Observatory is a group that monitors the movements of Russian and Syrian regime forces in order to warn rebel forces and civilians of impending attacks. On that day, they observe the departure of Russian warplanes from Hamayman Airport, which is considered to be a Russian military base. The warplanes shelled a makeshift hospital that belongs to Doctors Without Borders, south of Al Ma'ara city. Later, they monitored the departure of a MiG-23 belonging to the Syrian regime from Hama Airport and claimed that it raided Al Ma'ara National Hospital. We compare the observed departure times to the two different sets of bombings we have laid out on our timeline. In two of the videos, capturing the second attack on the MSF-supported facility at 9.45, we distinctly hear the sound of fighter planes flying overhead. Although the fighter plane cannot be seen in the footage, the sound suggests a low-flying plane. In this video, a voice off-screen can be heard saying the fourth Russian airstrike on Atiba al-Hudud hospital. Nafaz. 
In the video showing the 1155 attack on the National Hospital, the fighter jet performing the attack has been caught on camera. Although the low resolution still frame does not allow for a positive confirmation of the aircraft type, the silhouette does not discount the possibility that the aircraft could be the MiG-23 mentioned by the FSA observatory. In Syria, MiG-23s are used exclusively by the Syrian regime. If we rewind the footage and follow the trajectory of the plane, we can find what appears to be the moment when the plane drops its payload. Here, a voice off screen can be heard saying, 15th of February 2016, 6th air raid on Marat al numan and its outskirts. <laughs> This helps us validate the timing established by the shadow analysis, as it suggests that the narrator is aware that other attacks have happened earlier that morning. The title of the video suggests the attacks were undertaken by Syrian planes. An air raid by regime warplanes targets the area around the National Hospital in the town of Marat al numan 15th of February 2016. Both the video footage and the testimony tilt the balance of probability of the morning attack on the MSF-supported hospital to the Russian Air Force, while the attack on the National Hospital later that morning suggests a possible Syrian regime strike. This study has also demonstrated the repeated and systematic targeting of separate medical facilities throughout the morning of the 15th of February 2016. As this report shows, attacks on multiple medical facilities took place repeatedly and consistently throughout the morning, leaving Marat al numan and its surroundings critically deprived of much-needed medical infrastructure.